afternoon baseball here on the show ought to be a good one here between the New York Yankees and the Cleveland Indians digging in Aaron Hicks he will lead this one off today leading off the afternoon for the Yankees the center fielder Aaron Becomes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And we're underway as the first pitch is a check swing, but a called strike. 0 and 1. A ball and a strike to our leadoff man here this afternoon. And he comes back with a fastball. 1 and 2 now. Now time asked for and granted by the home plate umpire. Altogether a fine afternoon for baseball 66 degrees the game time temperature and a fastball is swung on and missed and there is your first out of the contest so the bases are empty with one man gone and that'll bring in D.J. LeMayhew first pitch on its way rolled slowly down the third baseline but this is foul for the first strike. The 0 1. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Grounded down the third baseline, but this will wind up foul. Still 0 and 2. Got to take advantage of that pitch right there. 0 2 breaker hanging over the heart of the plate. Not going to see too many of those today. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time. Out number That's two. Good. The right fielder, number 99, Aaron Young. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Swing and a miss, and he's behind 0 and 1. Hey, he's looking to punch out the side right here. And if this guy's going to do him favors and swing outside the zone, that's exactly what's going to happen. And a half swing here, but this is in there for a cold strike, too. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Into the box now, Jose Ramirez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom Leading half of the first. The third baseman. Okay. Now here's the pitch. And a ball 1 and 0. Oh. First two pitches off the mark here. It's 2 and 0. Oh. Pitch on the way. Behind on the swing that time and it's 2 and 1. Ball three. three and one now. He's only four pitches in, but he doesn't look too sharp to start the day off. The three one. And he takes ball four. So the leadoff man is on here in the home half of the first in a scoreless ball game. At the plate, Tyler Naquin. He'll get to take his first cuts here. He's set. Here it comes. And this one's in the dirt. Ball's there, and he is out. Good throw. The windup and the 1-0 pitch. And he watches one miss outside, 2-0 now. Naquin is a very well-regarded defensive outfielder. It used to be that fielders were evaluated mostly by the eyeball test and simple stats like fielding percentage. But, of course, these days, there are many more advanced ways that help determine a guy's work in the field. And in his case, he shines in many ways. You know, Matty, for me, I think he does pass the eyeball test. I know you have to look at all the numbers and the analytics to really appreciate a ball player like this. But man, does he come to work every day and play hard. Three and two now. Here comes the payoff pitch. Checked his swing there, and did he go? No, he did not, says the third base umpire, so it's ball four. 
Batting Digging in, Francisco Lindor. He'll swing it from the left side right here. Lindor. First delivery to him on the way. A swing, and this one is blasted to right field. Nothing's going to stop it. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. So now Carlos Santana. The first baseman. And so take a look at ball one. Bases are empty, one man out. Santana in front with a 2 0 count. Too far out in front that time. He can't keep it fair. 2 and 1. Now here it comes. That ball's headed for the gap in left center. He's got a base hit, possibly more. And he is in at second base with a one out double. That is the designated hitter. Zombie. And that'll bring oh, yeah. in Fran Moraes as he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. Santana leads off second with one gone in the inning. And this one's on the inside corner, one and one. Hey, after that extra base hit, things could go awry. He didn't. He battled right back in his zone with a nice executed pitch. A 1-1 home. Hey, strike two, swinging. I know he's been struggling early, but that pitch right there, well-executed changeup. If he can mix that in, maybe he hangs around for a little while longer. Ball two. Looks like this guy's afraid to throw the ball in the strike zone. Gave up that home run earlier in the inning. Needs to get back to being aggressive. Full count, three and two to the Indians' DH. This guy uses that two-seamer to set up his other pitches. Two-seamer in, breaking ball away. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Striding in, Oscar Mercado. And the Tribe with an opportunity for still more damage here in the first. Mercado. From the belt, the pitch. Already 24 pitches to this point in the inning. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be late on that fastball. The one-two. Line drive to center field. Hicks is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Second inning set to go, and standing in is the DH, Giancarlo Stanton. Giancarlo Stanton. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Check swing, but he held up in time. Ball one. And right into the shift. Ramirez is there. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Stepping up to the plate, Mike Talkman, as he'll get his first Mike opportunity in this Talkman. one. He's set and the pitch. Well out in front of the breaking ball there for a strike. Hey, from a pitcher's standpoint, sometimes the greatest pitch is the slider that backs up. He got away with that one, but he wants that thing to bury down the way. Half-hearted attempt that time, but they'll say he broke the plane, and that's out number two. Stepping into the box, Torres. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. And the pitch. And he couldn't hold back that time. They say he went around at strike one. That's taken. Now it's 0-2. 
Hey, this is an amazing inning right here. Attacking the zone, keeping his defense invested. Chance to get off the field super quick. Now a fastball as he just reared up and let that one fly, and the inning is over. In now for Cleveland, Cesar Hernandez. As the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. Pitch on the way. Hernandez. The 1 0. Hit down the line at first, but a foul ball, 1 and 1. Now the pitch. Check swing. No swing, says the home plate umpire. Ball 2. Name of the game out on the mound is to disrupt timing of the hitters in the box. He certainly got this guy on the defensive. 3 and 1 to him now. Called strike two, and now it's full three and two. Down the first baseline, but this will get foul, so they'll do it again, three and two. Payoff pitch one more time. And he takes ball four. Leadoff man's aboard here to begin the home half of the second. Now batting, Domingo Santana. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. Nope. Well, this second inning is not starting out any better than the first was. He just might not have it in this one. Here comes the 1-0. Fly ball out toward right field. Judges under it. One away. Standing in, Roberto Perez. The catcher. From the stretch. Runners on first with one down. He's going, he's and going. there he goes towards second. That's a strike to throw down. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. One and two count to the Indians catcher. High fastball right there with a two strike count. You know what that might be doing? Setting up the next pitch could be that hard slider down and away. Something breaking down and away off the plate. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there. Two away. Now batted. Third base. Coming to the plate now. Jose Ramirez. Runner in scoring position with Sugan. Now a spin and a throw back to second, and he'll dive back in. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Back up the middle. And that is through into center field, a base hit. And the run will score from second here as this is now a 3 0 game. The right fielder, number 30, Tyler. Infield shifts now. They'll overload to the right with the shortstop on the other side of the second base bag. So here's Tyler Naquin. As he'll watch one, one miss down and in for a ball, 1 0. Oh. No official at bat for him, but he has scored a run in this one. Base hit, line drive into the corner. And now it'll rattle up against the wall. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double.
So here's Francisco Lindor now as he looks at a fastball that misses off the plate for ball one. Even though we're still in the early going, I think this game's at a tipping point right now. They've got a chance to put this game out of reach, but if they can't score any more here, the other guys feel like the door's still open. Now a hard liner, but this will be a foul ball. One and one, here it is. Hit well on the ground to first. And a sliding try, but it's through, a base hit. And not in time as the run scores. A tag, and they get him at the plate as one run scores, but not the second. Leading off with the anchor, the third baseman, Miguel. And that'll bring up Miguel Andujar. As the first pitch to him is a changeup that can't find the zone. It's ball one. And they've got some work to do early on. Down 4 nothing already. This is popped up. Perez is there. He's got it one away. Digging in now for the Yankees. Mike Ford. Mike Ford. Here's the first pitch to him. Nope. Ball one. Now the 1-0 is swung on and missed in that strike one. A good fastball that backed him off the plate. And then some slow stuff down and away. That's one of the classic ways to mess up a hitter's timing. Up and in, down and away, textbook. Ready to deliver the one and two. Yankees still on the lookout for hit number one here. And he'll try to hold back, but he won't be able to as that's ruled a swing, and there are two away now. At the plate, Gary Sanchez. This guy is still looking at a zero in the hit column. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one, one and oh. Popped him up. Santana in foul ground. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Two out, nobody on. Pitch is popped up. And Santana will put the squeeze on this one, and the inning is over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and that'll bring in one of the best on-base percentage players in the game, Carlos Santana. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. There's no way around it. This has been a rough start on the mound, so it'll be interesting to see how long that man is going to let him go. Maybe he settles in and can give you another inning or so, but I wouldn't bet on it at this point. And, oh, he can't get out of the way of that one, so the leadoff man will be on to open the frame. Coming to the plate now, Fran Moreyes. 0 for 1 here in the early going. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Lifted in the air to center. After it is Hicks. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Standing in, Oscar Mercado. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Mercado. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Good pitch there. Had him a little out in front. High in the air out to center field. Hicks is under it. Two gone. Ready now, Cesar Hernandez. He scored after reaching on a walk in his first at bat. He's set. Here it comes. 
first pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 and 1. Hey that's a well executed pitch right there. That might have started middle but you saw it breaking away to that outer part of the zone. This left handed batter right here has got two decisions to make. Is he going to ground out to second base all day or he's going to drive the ball the other way. The 0 2 home swing and a miss blew the fastball right by him and the inning is over. New inning set to get underway and coming forward the veteran outfielder Aaron Hicks. Aaron Hicks. First pitch on its way. Hey he's got great feel for that pitch right there. He can throw it anytime he wants for a strike. On the ground for Hernandez at second base. Scooped up. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. So the base is empty here with one away and that'll bring up D.J. LeMayhew. First delivery to him on the way. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Naquin's on the move. That's a hit. The first of the game for the Yankees. And they're going to hold him to a single here as they do a nice job of getting it back in quickly. The right field, number 99. Aaron Judge. Here's big Aaron Judge as the first pitch to him is taken low and away for ball one. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Slapped hard the opposite way. And that'll get down for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now batter, the designated hitter, Giancarlo. Giancarlo Stanton now. This will chase one up around the letters here for strike one. And that misses one and one. Hey, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, that's right where you want to miss. Any lower, and he'll probably make you pay for it. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Hey, lots of guys get too aggressive in a spot like this, but he's done a nice job of gaining some count leverage. Look for him to put the ball and play hard. Reined in. Hernandez at second. Throw to Santana. The double play, and that's how the side is retired. Now at the plate, Domingo Santana flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. Domingo. Here's the pitch. Down the third baseline. A dive, but he can't make the play, and it's down the left field line. Now batting, catcher, Roberto Perez. Into the box now, Roberto Perez. As he'll swing and hit this one hard, but foul off to the left and out of play. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Ready with the 0 1. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0 and 2. Well, it's been a rough one so far. Four runs through three innings. It's about time to get that pitch count down, or he won't be out here very long. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed, and for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. The third baseman. Stepping in, Jose Ramirez. He came through with an RBI single in his last at bat. First pitch on its way. Four runs, six hits. No errors to this point for the Indians. And there's ball one. You can really tell about how effective this guy's going to be when guys are swinging at that changeup. So far in this one, they've been real smart to let it go. Count is one and two now. From the stretch. To two balls and two strikes now. Runner at first here, one man out. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Yeah, 
even at two balls and two strikes. Here's the pitch. And he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. Judge looks up. Gone! And next will be the versatile Tyler Naquin. As the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball, 1-0. and oh. He doubled his last time through. Hit out towards second. And the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. And that'll bring in the switch hitting Francisco Lindor. He's off to a fast start in this one. Two for two, including a home run. And he takes ball one. I'm sure he's frustrated by that call. Probably could have been a strike, but at the same time, earning strikes from the umpire is a real thing. If you've been all over the place like he has, you're just not going to get much help from the umpires. Indian shortstop behind one and two in the count. Hard hit to first. He's got it. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Leading off the inning, Mike Tuckman. And they'll need him to get something going here. He's set and the pitch. Check swing that time. They'll appeal down to third. And Mike Fillmore isn't buying it. It's ball one. One and no pitch on the way. This is skied into short left center. In comes the left fielder. He's there and records the first down. So striding forward now, Torres. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, and he didn't put up much of a fight either, Matty. Got to find a way. Can't go down three pitches. I don't care if you're staring at him or swinging at him. You have to find a way to make this pitcher work a little bit harder. Hey, it's a game of execution. If the pitcher stays right there, this lineup's going to continue to have a tough time. Count now a ball and a strike. And he fouls this one off. Had to be sitting something hard right there because he gave up on that pitch, but it was right down the chute. The one two he is swung on and missed strike three. Here's Miguel Andohar now. He's 0 for yeah, 1 thus far. The third base base. Miguel and Duhar. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hit out towards second. Off balance throw. Gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Set now for the bottom of the fifth. And next it'll be the switch hitting first baseman, Carlos Santana. Now the pitch. Into right field. That's a base hit. Now that the designated hitter, Rodney. Standing in now, Fran Moraes. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. I just couldn't pull that one back in time. It's 0 and 2 now. Now an off speed pitch that nearly ran in and got him. That was a changeup, so there really wasn't any intent behind it. Looked to me like it just slipped out of his hand a little bit. That'll happen sometimes because of the grip of that straight changeup. Two balls and two strikes now. He's set and the 2 2 pitch. Nearly got the inside, but ruled the ball. One of the things you want to do with a starter, get that pitch count up. Here's another productive at bat as this count now gets to three. Oh, and he extends nicely, and this ball's driven to right field and deep. And it's gone! <laughs> so 
So now to the plate, Oscar Mercado. And she'll take a look at a slider in the dirt, and it's ball one. Wow, that pitch wasn't even close, and he almost chased it. If I'm the pitcher, I'm going to expand the zone even more in the next one. And well off the plate with the change of pace, that's ball two. Nope. 3-0. and Well, I'll tell you, if he wants to turn things around, that pitch is one he's going to have to start locating a lot better. And he takes ball four, so he's on. And as you know, that often means the steal could be in order here. Look ready for another shot now. Cesar Hernandez. 0 for 1 with a run scored thus far. Chad Green gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. First pitch of the at bat. Here's a slider to start things out. Looked at for ball one. Here's a swing and a miss, one and one. Green, it's pretty much a manager's dream coming out of the bullpen. High strikeouts, doesn't walk a lot of batters, usually a recipe for a lot of success. Oh, that's one of the keys. I think if you were to build the perfect relief pitcher, you'd want a guy that throws a lot of strikes, that minimizes the base on balls, and nobody does it as good as this guy does right now in the game of baseball. Sent on the ground out to second. And that finds its way through for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. The left fielder, number 24. Jump and go. Jump At the plate now, Domingo Santana. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty, it's strike one. He's one for two in this one. That's in there. And he's deep in the hole now, 0-2. Fastball swung on and missed for the first down. Ready once again, Roberto Perez. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. From the stretch. Just missed with that heater, but even if he wanted to swing, I don't think he could have caught up to that one. He's ready. Here's the 1 0. A bouncer up the middle. Torres has it. LeMay Hugh for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Next for New York, Mike Ford. He's set to lead us off in the sixth inning. Mike Ford. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Hit hard to short. And that's through for a base hit. Make him one for two in this one. And a nice job to get the ball in quickly. He'll be held to a single here with nobody out. Now back. Check. Gary. Stepping in now. Gary Sanchez. As he'll come up empty there as he misses the off-speed pitch for strike one. Started to go around there, but he holds up ball one. Oh. Down low, two balls and a strike. A runner at first with no outs here. Swings through it for strike number two. Started to go. Did he hold up in time? Yes, says the first base umpire. It's ball three now. No walks yet. Here's the delivery. High in the air into shallow left center. Lindor backs up a bit and he takes charge for the first out. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Now back. now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping Aaron. in, Aaron Hicks. First pitch on its way. Nope, at the ball. Oh, that's a tough call for Blue right there. Either way you call it, somebody doesn't like it. But hey, that's the life of an umpire. 
Swing and a miss. Blew it right by him at 96. It's a ball and a strike. Hey, this guy's done a better job than expected. He's made some bad pitches in the strike zone, but so far he hasn't gotten hurt by him. Two balls and a strike now to the Yankees' leadoff man. Two balls and two strikes to Hicks now. Hey, I love the mindset of this pitcher right here. Try and dominate and execute a fastball in, and then get the guy sitting inside trying to be quick to everything, and then pull the string a little bit on a nasty changeup. Mercado is there, two gone. Digging in and looking for more. Now DJ LeMayhew. He singled his last DJ. time up. LeMayhew. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. No runs, three hits, and no errors for the Yankees so far. And it's fouled away. One and two to DJ LeMayhew. Can't waste getting the leadoff runner on in this situation. Someone's got to bear down and get a big knock. The one two. I got to count. Two well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away. So now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. Hit back up the middle. A dive and he knocks it down. And not really much of a chance to recover there as he'll reach first on what undoubtedly will be scored as an infield single. The right field, number 99, Aaron Hill. And that'll bring up Aaron Judge as he'll get caught chasing a bad one there at strike one. Hey, this isn't exactly the way you'd like to draw it up. Not throwing a lot of first pitch strikes, but the bottom line is he's getting outs. Oh, and you talk about a pitcher getting the benefit of the doubt. That's low, but called a strike anyway. Nothing in two now. Well, the Yankees have been searching for that big hit pretty much all game. It remains to see if they can get it, but now it sure would be a good time. And he struck him out. His eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Ready to take his hacks again. Jose Ramirez. As he'll look to follow up the two run homer he launched over the wall last time up. I mean, what a diamond in the rough Jose Ramirez has been for Terry Francona and the Cleveland Indians. This guy burst on the scene in 2016. Just absolutely set that lineup on fire. They were looking for a guy to bail out Michael Brantley in the production they would miss from. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Throws in time, and that's out number one. Striding in for the Indians, Tyler Naquin. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Off the plate, ball one. The 1 0. It is a fastball in off the plate for a ball. Adam Adovino is forced onto the mound now following the injury. Number zero, Adam. One out, nobody on. In there, two and one. Nasty 2-0 slider right there for a strike. No shame in tipping your hat. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. He stays alive, still two and two. Bases are empty, one man out. And the slider gets him swinging, two gone. 
Settling in now, Francisco Lindor. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. And that is off the wall. And it's gone as they add still another. Now that the first base Here's Carlos Santana now. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. That's inside. 2 and 0. Oh. That's a good pitch to lay off right there, that cutter inside. And that is a real tough pitch for hitters to lay off of. And a lot of times, if you do swing at that cutter in, you're going to end up with some firewood and a broken bat. Hitters count now. Here's the 2 and 1. Bases are empty here with two men out. And this one misses to Santana, and he'll take that free pass down to first. Ready to take his hacks again, Friend Reyes, as he'll look to follow up the two-run homer he launched over the wall last time up. The last at bat, Matty D. We heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off-speed pitches. Pitch is mishandled behind the plate, and it bounces away. And a leap, but it's fired right over his head. And lucky for them, the right fielder is there to back up the throw. The 1-0. -oh. -oh. Well, you have to have a lot of confidence and composure to pitch effectively. And right now, I'm just not seeing it. He looks kind of rattled out there to me. And a very low strike there. Trying to speed up the game, perhaps. It's two and one. Oh, textbook slider there, and he's back at even two and two. Not much you're going to do with that pitch right there. You have to catch it out front before it even breaks, and even if you do that, it's a tough pitch to keep fair. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Hicks going back. But he has no chance to make the play. It's off the wall. They'll add on to their total as the run scores all the way from first. Up next to Cleveland, the center fielder. Oh, God. Well, the way things unfolded, you kind of had a sense that this thing was going to end in dramatic fashion, and that's exactly what happened. A walk-off for the win? Wow. Well, we talked about his dominance all throughout the game, and he ended up finishing what he started, a complete game shutout. He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, there's absolutely no debate as far as I'm concerned. He